All right, so we have Steve Berliner here, who just won his silver medal at Nationals. Um, he's going to talk a little bit about why the pickleball is the sport that he chose to play. And I think we'll start it off with, um, uh, what about the pickleball community, like, drives you so much to the sport? Like, you talked about that you can meet so many great people playing the game. Is there something about the community that stands out? Well, everybody in pickleball is friendly and welcoming. Mm -hmm. And I've played these other racket sports my whole life, and it's very different in terms of the social community yeah. that you feel. Um, it may be due to the fact that you get a good number of people together at the same time, mm -hmm. uh, which we don't seem to do in tennis. We kind of get our one court. Yeah. We're isolated. We probably don't know the people mm -hmm. on the next court, very likely. Uh, in table tennis, we're, we're isolated at our table. Um, there's something about pickleball, the way we gather around the court and mingle. And then when you have a club like Rex, mm -hmm. um, there's really a lot of uh, social mixing opportunity. And it, for me, it's not as separate from my playing. It's not like uh, just going to the lounge to socialize. Uh -huh. so we can do that. Yeah. We love to have our beer here. Uh -huh. um, <laughs> One of the few clubs, I, I bet, that has a beer on tap. Uh -huh. like this. Um, but just out on the courts, we uh, a lot of people that know each other uh, week in, week out, and just socialize. And we mix a lot during our play, too. Yeah. So many of the events are ladders where we split partners uh, after every brief game. Mm -hmm you know, of 12 minutes and uh, play with a different partner. And you really get to know people. Yeah. So everybody in their path on their pickleball career has had one person or another kind of help them on their way more than others. Is there anyone that has done that, especially for you throughout your life in pickleball, your three years on pickleball? Yeah, very much. Actually, um, before I joined Rex here, because that was at the beginning of my third year mm -hmm. of pickleball, and I was very fortunate to be brought along in the game by a, a now Rex instructor, Steve Perrano, uh, one of the key instructors here, uh, with 40 years of experience and a lot of national titles and medals, um, and he's just a real coach. and. He shared so much with me in recreational play to bring me along um, and let me know what I needed to do differently to move ahead at every level. Yeah. And he was just so generous uh, with advice uh, without pushing it on to me um, that I consider him my main mentor and I'm very grateful for the help he's given me. All right. Okay, Steve, so what makes pickleball, like, a lot more fun than other sports you've played, or what drives you to the game over other sports that you've played? Yeah, I've, I've just about completed my third year of pickleball play mm -hmm. after an entire lifetime of playing tennis and table tennis yeah. competitively in both cases, and I'm just finding the pickleball so much more fun. Uh -huh. um, <laughs> Because the rallies can be very long, mm -hmm. they can be very surprising. Yeah. Um, things happen during a rally that we just laugh about. <laughs> um, you know, that's in rec play. Mm -hmm. But even in competitive play, the longer rally sequences and the, the progression of the uh, slow, intricate dinking yeah. into the fast back and forth volleying and then anything goes anything can happen after that mm -hmm. is just uh, way more fun than what happens in a rally in the other sports yeah